my people welcome welcome back to the news channel and this is afri's concept tv where you get the latest and the oldest news this is a news channel that keeps you updated on everything going on in the country if you are yet to subscribe to this channel make sure to do that now and if you are a new subscriber we say welcome to afri's concept tv sit back and relax because you are going to be getting everything that you are going to need to be updated on the happenings in the country and even outside the country and also if you are a returning subscriber i say welcome back to afri's concept tv and i'm sure you are you keep coming back because you get value from this channel let's go right to the headlines for today democracy day stop celebrating a line Nigeria is not a democracy. And yes, my people, this is the headlines for today. As we've seen that, said that democracy, that Nigeria is not celebrate, is not working in democracy. Let's listen to the news info. Bola Tinubu, Nigeria's president, tripped and fell as he climbed the steps of the parade vehicle during this year's Democracy Day event. Characteristically, Tinubu dismissed the incident, saying Idobale, that is prostrated for democracy. But in truth, Tinubu's stumble is a perfect metaphor for the statement of democracy in Nigeria. For let's face it, Nigerian democracy is so inherently wobbly that it is prone to tripping and falling. Indeed, Nigeria is not a true democracy at all. And to continue to celebrate a failed system, Instead of admitting and tackling the failure is to entrench and perpetuate a lie. Sadly, there is a conspiracy of silence in Nigeria that allows the fetishization of something called democracy just to give the political class a fig leaf to pretend that they represent the people, when in fact they mainly serve their own interests and those of their families, friends and cronies. And when what is called elections in Nigeria is just a periodic celebration of collective powerlessness by Nigerians, that lie, that farce, needs to be, a, needs a correction. To start with, what does democracy day mean in Nigeria? Well, it stands for two things, both rooted in deceit. First, democracy day celebrate Nigerians' return to civil rule on May 29, 1999, and thus marks to date 25 years of uninterrupted democracy. However, since Democracy Day has commemorated, however, since 2019, Democracy Day has commemorated the June 12, 1993 presidential election annulled by General Ibrahim Babagin, that's military regime. For those who push for June 12 rather than May 29 as Democracy Day, the former sowed the seeds of democracy that Nigeria enjoys today. Yet whether you take the journey from June 12, 1993 or from May 29, 1999, the truth is that neither represented true democracy. Let's start with the 1993 presidential election. What was democratic in politicians running for elections under military parties? created by the military, whose constitution and manifestos were decreed by the military. Yet in their desperation for power, the politicians rushed unquestioningly into the two military contraption National Republican Convention and Social Democratic Party SDP, like sheep being led to the slaughter. Indeed, MQ Abiola, the presumed winner of the annulled election, joined the SDP just a month before securing the party's ticket, and only after Baginda had disqualified several presidential aspirants, including Adamu Siroma and General Shehu Yaradua, who won the primaries of the NRC and SDP, respectively. Indeed, Nigeria is not a true democracy at all, and to continue to celebrate a failed system instead of admitting and tackling the failure is to entrench and perpetuate a lie. And yes, my people, this is the news for today. As we see that um, they've come out, the news channel has come out to talk about all the issues that has been happening lately in the states, going back down history lane, right from when 
there was well, that's when democracy started and also the annulled election in 1993 from by um towards mk abiola after he won and yes this is the news as we've seen that so many things have gone wrong in the state and obviously it feels like we are celebrating a failed democracy and yes my people that is the news for today make sure to like the video comment let us know what you think about this news let us know your your mind regarding this news that you've just listened to because we are very interested in your feedback and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel and also click on the notification bell so that youtube will notify you every time that we post up a new content look forward to seeing you again thank you